Good morning. Let me make you a cup of coffee. So this past year, I started rethinking what home decor could be. And honestly, that's a mistake. I'm not good at home decor at all. <laughs> I'm not one of those wives that like can replicate awesome stuff off the internet. It's just, it's chaos is what my home decor is like. But I started being intentional with the chaos and I'm really grateful I did. So one of the things I started doing is growing winter squash. You know, you have your summer squashes like zucchini and all that stuff, the things that we're used to seeing more often. Uh, but those are weak squashes. They are really delicious and nutritious, but they do not store well. Winter squashes, you grow them over the summer. They're not something you grow in the winter. Winter squashes are called so because they last all winter. I grew these over the summer. And like our last frost day was in October. So like two months, they've been sitting around looking cute. <laughs> and it's food storage available to us no matter what. So like in the event that something like what happened in North Carolina happens, our power grid is attacked and our fridges go out and our freezers go out and we have a big, big issue of food waste on our hands that we have to handle. We got random winter squashes chicken eggs farm fresh chicken eggs don't have to go in the fridge they just sit on here so that in the event that our power grid is attacked our home decor could feed us if we stopped giving into the target trends i know that it's cute and awesome but like imagine if we replaced five dollar target trends with organic produce you grew from your lawn that can feed your family in case something happens and it's cute. Tell me, like, we will buy, I think, we will buy these plastic. We will buy all of these things in the plastic form. Whereas the normal form that feeds our bodies, gives us good health and security, is just as cute. <laughs> I don't know how we make backyard chickens trend in winter squash home decor, but I think it's worth trying for real. Let me finish this coffee, by the way. Uh, happy Monday, y'all. I hope you have a great week. For real. See you tomorrow. I love you. We got this. Let's go.